hi guys welcome back to my channel my name is Duni and if it's your first time on this channel welcome 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 on this channel I talk about everything and anything literally just exposing my life out there for you guys entertainment basically <laughs> back with a story time so I'm going to talk about the time I went ahead or I went to embarrass myself and my future generations to come like literally so a few weeks back I went to a, a Korean restaurant we saw a few friends of mine and for the love of Korean culture, you guys already know how much I love K-drama and I watch K-drama like almost every time. Uh, yeah, first time never been, you know, never had any Korean food. So we got there, it was really nice, it was in the evening time, the restaurant scenery just took me back to the K-dramas I used to watch or I watched basically. It felt like I was in a movie, it literally felt like I was freaking out, I was acting like a baby, just freaking out and taking videos. In short, I'm sure I embarrassed my friend because they're like, oh, because I can't take this girl a new view. <laughs> was basically i was acting like a kid uh, it was nice you know we had uh, this barbecue um stove stuff where you like fry your meat basically it was really nice so they they um put us put us um in the setting on the table or whatever the way you had the stove in the middle and then you literally you know prep the stove with um butter and then you put it in and fry they have soy sauce they had so many sides so we ordered a platter with different um platter of food with different size size sides basically and we shared it and it was nice like the beef was a lot a lot there was beef i think there was chicken as well we ordered that but before i even get into the food just the scenery itself it was fantastic it like like how it is in korean movies if you're into k-drama basically um where you have like private rooms where you can eat and dine and you know that's what they used to talk about all the evil things that they want to do basically the politicians you know <laughs> it's not like that it's not like that and then you know all regular people will stay outside and eat and jolly and blah 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 but that inner corner we really wanted to go to the inner corner as well i think it was fueled right but yeah but it was fun it was fun and then the time came for us to eat you know me being <laughs> let's just let's just put it that way like you know being a JJC, you know i never really used chopsticks like actively you know use chopsticks chopsticks so that would be my second time of attempting to use chopsticks and i definitely failed I felt woefully. I was just embarrassing myself. In short, I think I embarrassed my friends so much more that they started doing videos of me. Like I'm just gonna put it here. They started doing the videos of me using the chopsticks. It wasn't funny. So yeah. So my children and my future children come. I'm really sorry. You know, I'm really sorry. I wish. I mean, if I was on a date with a crush or somebody I liked, you know, and I did that, I would just wish the ground just open up like and swallow me immediately. It was cringy like <laughs> it was just somehow like i don't know like yes i know i'm i should bring it up to know but i'm used to spoon and forks and whatnot and i never had the opportunity to go out and use the chopsticks anyways we shall use chopsticks we use chopsticks and i think i got the hang of it later on although the following day i did a video of myself using the chopsticks eating noodles mm -hmm. but i don't like to to quit i don't like to <laughs> i don't like when people make jest of me right so yeah it was it was a very very nice experience overall the food was really nice kimchi is not that bad kimchi is like cabbage um fermented cabbage or cabbage in fermented oil i really don't know how it's made it but i know something is fermented basically yeah overall overall basically it was a great experience and i had soju soju for the first time i said i was there was no way i was not going to have soju like i come to korea and i'm not having soju impossible so i had soju and man that thing is strong i used to feel like these guys used to exaggerate you know when they take two bottles and somebody's already passed out like knocked out they already act like they're drunk men <laughs> i shared one bottle and i shared it with my friends although i took the most but i was tipsy i was i was tipsy <laughs> that thing is strong i don't know where they make it up but it is strong anyways but in general it was a fun experience i thought to share my experience with you guys you know just make you guys laugh a little i guess i hope you love this video and if this is the kind of content and many more that you like right do not forget to you know as you're binging my videos and trying to see what i'm all about please don't forget to subscribe and leave a comment below let me know what next you guys like to see or basically your experiences with um, eating food from other people's culture like let me just know it was yeah it was a nice experience basically and i'm a very very enthusiastic person when it comes to food mm -hmm. so it was really nice really really nice Anyways, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.